Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is my project pan. This is the my November update. So I will have another update on the last day of December. So maybe, or January 1st, maybe I'll do that. Let's just get on to this update. I have some good news and some bad news. So let's roll the clips. <laughs> Happy Vlogmas day six. Today is a very special day because one of my packages that I bought on Black Friday arrives tonight and I'm so excited. Ah, uh, you, oh my God, oh my God. You're so excited, I can't wait to show you guys. Okay, so my whole Project Pan playlist will be linked down below. I started it this year and I'm doing pretty good. If you want to catch up with me, see how much I have progress I have made, check that playlist out. I will be doing a end of the year update. So let's roll the clips. Okay, so the first item that I brought in last month is the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Eye Base. I really like this. I thought I would finish this, but I did not. I did not. Um, I don't use this every day. I use it like every few days. So that's how much we have left, which means this will be finished <laughs> at the end of the month. And I really like this. So I think that I'm actually going to purchase a full size. I'm, I'm going to see if Macy's or Nordstrom is having a sale with it because I really like it and I need it. <laughs> okay, so next is my Fenty bronzer and this is the Sunstalker bronzer in the shade Into Sun. This is the first shade I believe and it is so light on me. This is what it looks like. You guys, I have been scraping at this. Honestly, I have been scraping a little bit too much because I just want to finish this I'm tired of looking at this and I don't want it in my collection collection anymore So this will be done in like two weeks. I Am betting you guys it will be done in two weeks. I just don't I Just don't use it and I'm tired of seeing it. So I'm gonna have it done next bronzer is my Becca bronzer This is in Capri Coast This is so pretty. I love this one so much. So this is getting really thin, like so much that it's just scraping pieces off every time I dip my brush into it. So I feel like this is gonna go quicker than it has been, which is good, but also really sad because I don't wanna open my new other one. But yeah, the formula is really thin right now. So I think that this is, this is going to go really quick. So I'm hoping to have at least like half of this, maybe like, I don't know. I'm hoping to have a lot of this done by the end of the month. I have been using it as eyeshadow and I really like it. So next is the Charlotte Tilbury face powder. This is in number two, the Flawless face powder. Sorry, I gotta hold my hand up because it's so tiny. This is where we are at. This is okay. I'm actually tired of seeing this also. And it's like what's left is around the pan, which really sucks because it's hard to scrape that out. So I'm hoping to have like half of this finished by the end of December. Um, it would be great if I could have it all finished, but I don't think it'll be finished. I think that at the end of December, when I do my final update, I'm just going to toss it because it is a mini and it's basically done in my eyes. So I'm gonna keep working at this, but I do wanna see a ton of progress at the end of the month. So the next bronzer is the Maybelline City Bronzer. This is also one of my favorites as of right now. I did have a usage goal of six. Oh my God, can you already see pan? But I only used it four times, so there's that. <laughs> I didn't use it much because I have been focusing on my Becca one, but I do like this and I'm just gonna keep using it in. I'm gonna do a usage goal of five for this one. Okay, so you guys, I have my Marc Jacobs bronzer. If you don't watch any of my vlogs, you wouldn't know this, but in one of my vlogs, I was doing a makeup tutorial, like I was doing my makeup and it just collapsed inside. So <laughs> I'm really embarrassed. Like that's how heavy handed I am. Literally tapped it like five times and it collapsed. But I have had this blush for about three years. So I'm not surprised. This looks really freaky. So mm, I don't know what I want to do. I think I might 
offer it to one of my sisters because they don't really care like of the brand of bronzer um so they might actually like this if not i'm gonna throw it out or maybe i'll just save it and start it in the new project pan to even this out because i really don't like the crater in the crack i, I can't keep looking at that i'm gonna freak out <sighs> okay so moving on to blush i have one blush and this is my elf spiced apple blush i love this i love this i love this this blush has been a staple in my collection for the last like eight months i really love it so much i also love this highlighter for actually eyeshadow it's a great one and done eyeshadow look it's so pretty um so yeah but it is really pretty so i just love this one this blush so much <sighs> just go buy this blush i know i say it in every project pan but i'm not lying go buy this <laughs> it's so good <gasps> i could marry this blush the next blush is the nude sticks sweet peach peony I forgot to grab that out of my bedroom and I really don't want to go back and get it, but I did not use it at all. So I am officially taking that out of my project pan and I will bring that back in, I think maybe March. That's like the springtime and I will be in Florida. So I'm definitely going to want some cream. I'm going to bring that out. But as of right now, that is leaving my project pan. It was great. I used that blush all summer along with my e.l.f. and those two were just staples. All right, so next is my highlighter, and this is the Becca highlighter in Champagne Toast or Champagne Pop. Oh my gosh, you guys, it is candle day, so <laughs> I've been thinking about candles all day, even though I did not buy any, so props to me, but I do need another Champagne Toast. So this is where we are at. Just a little update. I did get it down a little bit, and I have just been working on literally using this whole spot and just making it thinner if that makes sense i've been like just going over it to make it thinner because i do not want to have like one side very thin and the other side super thick like it has been so that's what i've been doing um have it on my nose and in the corner of my eyes and i just love this highlighter if you guys have not picked this up it is now sold by new um smashbox I highly recommend you pick this highlighter up. The next one product is my eyeshadow, and this is the Too Faced Hot Buttered Rum eyeshadow palette. This is where we are at on this shade, and this is in the shade Vanilla Extra. Love it so much. I literally use it over the lid, like base color, before I do anything, if I do anything else. But if not, it's usually just my one eyeshadow which is really good because my eyes are like really dark and veiny as you can see so this this nude color really does blend it all in and make my face look a little brighter if that makes sense let me know down below so this is my tower 28 jelly in oat milk this is where we are at we're getting down there looks really nice oh you can tell i can make straight lines <laughs> right <laughs> um I've been using this one a lot more. I don't know why. i just been loving the milky, pinky look lately. I don't know if you can tell. It's really been complementing my lips and my natural lip color, so I have been using this one a lot lately. My other one is in my purse, and I have not touched it, so sad. I haven't touched it because I've been using this one, but that is it for this Project Pan update. I can't believe my Marc Jacobs literally cracked like that it's so embarrassing and it's really freaky and i've also i've heard of the mark jacob um bronzers doing that so someone else had it happen to them and i thought it was really weird and now it happened to me so i am not happy about it but also i have not used that bronzer much so maybe it's just drying out i don't know let me know if you guys have any ideas what that means i'm gonna go now i hope you guys had a great day and i will see you in my next video bye